On the microscopic level, every act of observation is disruptive. And the manner in which we choose to make the observation influences the results of that interaction. And if I told you who they were, listeners, so what? What would you do with them? Skin refracts in your eye made of matter and light. Try to possess it. Light makes a shadow, an absence, the only way to dream. The dark covers, so you see only darkness as a force you cannot master. It hides the eyes, reflect, refracting the whole. You say, I thought I saw a woman in the window, but it was only an object. I do not cover myself, but think sometimes of how I would hide from the periphery of other people's pictures. Their eyes weigh on my shoulder, my face, the strangers on the bus, an older man and a young girl, dense strawberry hair and a braid I used to wish for as a child. An elder appeared before me in a lucid dream. I have tried to speak of it for years. We assume every apparition wishes for us to speak on their behalf. Maybe the problem with us is our aspiration to possess everything that haunts us. I think as I walk home, the excess of someone else's life lingers in the air, burns the eyes. I watch John Acumfra's vertigo see, and I keep thinking we keep killing everything we don't understand, or we name it. For everything we wish to unname, what do we trim away? Revive. Deep inside, my lung is squeaking, wanting more air. I cannot give it. I listen to the reporter asking the informant to tell him more about a place across the world, about how a place across the world defied his expectations. I turn the radio off. The laws of illumination. You cannot know what you cannot see. Therefore, I keep it to myself. But look how the shadow shields her face and how he bears his book toward the sun. This is the image I cannot show you. This is your outline, this not mine. A crook in the hand to speak for years. The mark, the wave, and the wave, the sea. How holy they have crossed. This is what you cannot see. It bears a sharpness, sepia stain. It bears a light, a crescent moon a hook to throw back the sun. Now see the book. The book is feeling. Picture within a picture. This, the finger in the corner. You have asked me for sharpness. Assume that all I speak here is with absolute precision. <laughs>